It has to have all the elements, the legs, the pincers, the eye stalks, the antenna. So I took a few images, the shadow looked amazing, the lighting was great, yet there was just something missing. Coconut crabs are a really good indicator of how untouched and how pristine an island environment really is. They're large, they're fairly predictable, they're pretty slow, and they taste phenomenal, I've heard. And looking at the sheer number of coconut crabs on the atoll, it really illustrates how untouched and how intact Aldabra's terrestrial environment really is. What are you doing in there, buddy? You're always feisty. You are feisty. They're the largest terrestrial crustacean on our planet, two, three kgs in weight. There is talk about leg spans of three foot plus. They are the true beast of the crustacean world. So one evening, when one of the rangers was measuring one of the larger crabs, her head torch cast a shadow onto the ground. And it was this most incredible, arachnid, science fiction shadow that was just so iconic. And so I have to somehow incorporate that beast-like silhouette into the image of the coconut crab. I really wanted to pay homage to all those horror and science fiction films because a lot of these alien creatures have a crab-like resemblance. As I was walking back to the station, I walked past this old coral rock building here, and I took my torch, put it sort of eye level with a large crab that was sitting in front of the building, and it cast the most kick-ass shadow. It was just one of those, just like you go, whoa. So I had a person in the doorway, and all of a sudden, the first image started coming together, and you start going, okay, all right, this is working. You know, the balance of the image, the light, the head torch, the light streaming out, and of course, and the crab shadow on the wall. There was again one element missing. And as I was thinking about that, there was a crab that was scuttling along, and that was the last piece of the puzzle, the last element that had to come together. 